As you guys know, I recently purchased a 2023 Ford F-250. A couple days after purchasing this truck, I was looking around the internet for some mods I wanted to do to it, and I came across this video. This video is my same exact truck, but obviously on some crazy suspension setup, and it's built by the guys at CJC. Now, you guys also sent me a bunch of messages saying that these are the guys that do the best Ford suspension possible. So here we are this morning, I have found myself at CJC, and I am dedicated to filming that exact shot of my truck hitting a whoop section at 50 miles an hour, but I wanna be doing it in my truck. We're right outside their building, and before we start this whole entire transformation, this is what my truck currently looks like. It's a 2023 F-250 Lariat with a 6.7 power stroke, and it has the tremor package. It essentially just means it has a few more bits that are tailored to an off-road style and suspension, but today, we're gonna be changing everything and replacing it out with something 10 times better. All right, so this right here is Cody. Cody is the man behind CJC. Thank you for having me here. Oh, no, thanks for coming up. So he is the man behind the plan here. And in the back of this truck, we have everything that we need and a few more things coming. So stay yeah. posted of what we need to make our truck do that video. So what does it all entail? So this is going to be a Carly suspension eVenture leveling system. The eVenture is the electric shocks that you saw in that video and a couple million people saw and really wanted. Yeah. And we're going to be running the Carly suspension system. So all of their systems come with soft riding springs and a plethora of just custom parts, right? So all these are hand welded in Southern California. Whoa, literally pure man, beef. That's, um, that's pretty yeah. heavy. The spring rates are gonna be really key in getting the systems to work well. So all of the front and rear springs have been tuned to work with the shock package and vice versa. So this shock package is what really caught a lot of people's attention online. This is gonna be the Carly that eVenture shock package. Dude, coming from the world of cars, <laughs> seeing how big this canister is, that's insane. So if you have seen like a King Ray shock, this is gonna be similar to 2.5 inch shock, but the shock is essentially electronically controlled. It's reading your inputs from the steering, the brake, so you'll actually feel the truck firm up when you hit the brakes, you swerve the truck firms up, and then we can put it in Baja and or rock crawl mode and do what you saw in that video. So it's like, it's, it's like essentially like EDC in BMW. It's like electronic dampening control around yeah. the car, and we're yeah. putting that on the truck. Yeah, and so where a lot of other brands just have like an electronically adjustable shock, this one's actually reading your input. So it's like adaptive. In. Yeah, it's like a couple hundred times a second. So, so. is there like an onboard, like, yeah, for lack of better words, yeah. like computer? When ECU? you come back, there's gonna be a little A pillar. Instead of being a gauge, it's a full computer that you can adjust the settings. And then you actually, with someone who knows what they're doing, can actually go in and dial it in even more. So first off, I just need to say, shout out to everyone watching this video, because when I first posted that I got this truck, I got thousands of DMs on Instagram saying, you need to go to CJC, you need to put car suspension on it. Here we are. Yeah, so yeah. I'm gonna let I'm gonna let you guys get to work. I'm antsy to take this thing out to the desert. Hopefully we don't flip the car and crash. That'd be really bad, a really bad promotion for all of this, but it's gonna be sick. Yep, get out of here. We'll Good see you luck. in a couple days. I'll Ooh, go out to the desert and have some fun. I'm so hyped. TJ tossed us to the keys, so we want to get started on this truck immediately. This is not your average lift kit. I know some of you guys are going to ask, what is so special about TJ just getting a lift kit? This is a true performance suspension system, and this is, again, going to allow him to do some crazy things with this 8,000-pound truck. Diving into the front of this truck, this is, even though we would call it a leveling system, this is not just a leveling kit, a quick hockey puck you throw in the front of the truck. Carly Suspension taps into their desert racing lineage, giving you a truly high-performing suspension system, and in touch, there's a ton of front end components that go along with one of these systems. Looking at this system specifically, again, as I mentioned earlier, this is the eVenture suspension system. It's gonna be an electronically adjusting shock. So this shock is going to restrict or allow more oil flow, always reading variables in the truck, both from the driver's seat, you know, again, the steering wheel, brakes, throttle, as well as the overall pitch and the angles of the truck. So it's reading a ton of things to just make for an overall very cool feel. It also has different modes. Um, if you wanna find out more about the suspension system, head on over to our channel. We have some very in-depth videos. As I get older each year, one thing is constantly living in the back of my mind. And that is the question, will I lose my hair? Now, I don't know about you guys, but I love my hair. It's thick, it's full. I don't wanna see it leave anytime soon. And a sad staggering fact is that 80% of males will experience some sort of male pattern baldness by the time they're 35 years old. Now, sadly, that's a fact, but it doesn't have to apply to you. And that's why today's video is sponsored by Nutrafol, a clinically tested hair growth supplement for men. 
Nutrafol is the number one dermatologist recommended hair growth supplement brand with over a million people seeing thicker, stronger, faster growing hair with less shedding. A standout fact about Nutrafol is the medication is these pills that comes in this nice little container that can sit in your bathroom. All you do is you take four of these bad boys every day with a meal and that's it. There's also a test that you can take online on their website that helps specify what plan is best for you. So you're not just getting some generic supplement that is supposed to help everyone. It's specifically dialed down to you. There's no prescription and no doctor visits required and you don't even need to leave the comfort of your own home. Everything is automated and it will get shipped directly to you and you'll start to see results in three to six months. Take the first step to visibly nicer and healthier hair. I was able to get you guys $10 off your first month subscription and free shipping and all you have to do is go to Nutrafol.com forward slash men and use code TJH10 or just click the links down below and enter the code. That's Nutrafol.com forward slash men and use my code. Thank you Nutrafol for sponsoring today's video and now let's get back to it. Now we're getting back to TJ's truck. You're gonna have the custom tuned spring and shock package which is at the heart of every Carly suspension system. And in TJ's style, this truck got the full catalog so it's gonna have the torsion sway bar allowing for a really smooth ride on road but working really well off road at the same time and not hurting his towing needs. It's also gonna have steering stabilizers, which are gonna control his 37 inch tires, especially if he's gonna be making a video very similar to what we've done. And lastly up front, it's gonna have the fabricated radius arms. As TJ mentioned, they are pure beef. It is 100% made in the USA, welded in the USA part, something that most other brands can't even talk about these days. Now to match the almost 10 inches of travel we have up front, we have the Carly Leaf Pack in the rear, which is going to total almost 13 inches of suspension travel. Again, it is gonna be a custom tuned spring and shock combination in the rear. So it's gonna really allow this truck to get af after it off road. Now, TJ's use of needing a fun truck as well as a tow truck, the key piece of that is going to be this full travel airbag system. So what this airbag system does is it acts as a traditional airbag when he's gonna put the load on the rear of the truck, he's going to haul, et cetera, or even pick his razor out, things like that. However, when he does wanna have a little bit of fun off road, he's simply gonna slide this airbag cradle system out of the way, and that's going to allow for full suspension travel, allow him to essentially jump this truck with no issue. Something that has always been an issue with traditional airbags where they tear off road, where they restrict the suspension travel, things like that, that is no longer an issue thanks to this airbag kit. From here, we're gonna wrap up this installation and get the keys back to TJ and see what he can do with this build. You are We're in the middle of the desert right now and this is the first time being reunited with the truck and it looks so good. I looked at a couple different trucks online before doing this whole setup and I'm so happy that I did because this thing was like a monster truck. I feel like I have the off-road Raptor but I have the Super Duty package behind it. I'm so excited. So to go over what we have, we have the KMC wheels, we have the Nittos and we have the full Carly suspension package on this. Look how beefy the whole suspension setup looks. This is a little out of my element. I come from more of the cars and, and the racetrack, but seeing the whole entire package, the whole presence of the truck is entirely changed. I'm so excited to actually go out and go and drive it. And as you can tell, the original mission statement to this whole entire video to this truck is I wanna rip it. I wanna recreate that video. But before we do that, I'm gonna bring Cody in and just Dude, thank you so much, I'm so hyped. Our goal is to take a tow rig and make it both a tow rig and a play rig, right? Like we talked about that before. So this is considered kind of a leveling kit, but instead of just being a, an exhaust spacer, it's a full suspension system. So we've doubled all your suspension travel. Your rear even has more than double suspension travel that came stock. So all around, you're gonna have the electronically adjustable shock. So again, that dial pad on your A-pillar, we're able to adjust how the shocks react. Um, all the supporting parts to make 37 inch tires feel like car tires underneath this truck. So you have steering stabilizers, upgraded sway bars, soft riding leaf springs, and then the custom airbag setup that allows you to tow and then unhook it and go essentially jump the truck. Let's cut to the chase here. All these parts are cool. Spending a lot of money on really nice parts makes you feel good and stands out to your friends. But that's not what we're here for today. We're here to actually test these products and to see can we make this truck look like a trophy truck. Let's go find out. I have the truck I know and it's Baja mode. This is gonna be my first impression of driving it. I don't really know what to expect because the only like experience I really have is my Razor. And I need to like remember I'm not driving a Razor, I'm driving a 
6,000 plus pound Super Duty F-250. But I'm excited. The guys in front of me are gonna lead. We're gonna follow them. So I'm in two-wheel drive. Whoa, 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 God, okay. Oh my God. It's so comfortable. I mean, obviously that's what it's supposed to do, but this truck with its factory suspension setup is very, very stiff. And as it's supposed to be, it's a tow rig, but I can't see anything, I'm blind. But with this setup, man, it feels so good. I mean, I'm going 55 miles an hour right now. And let me tell you, <laughs> it's very confidence inspiring. It's almost like a false sense of how good I really am. And the truck's like not even making any noise on the inside. Like it's taking everything so incredibly well. I'm gonna switch to four wheel drive for fun here. To engage, release, there it is. Four by four in progress. Here we go. Now we're on four by four. Wow, the acceleration so much more in 4x4 because now the front wheels are actually delivering power. And the active electronic dampening control, I can see on this little display, it's stiffen up each shock individually as it's taking its inputs as we're driving, which is a really cool factor to see. It literally feels like an OEM application. But powering out of the corners, it just moves. Talk about a fun experience too. I mean, to be able to do both of everything. <laughs> Hell yeah, we're pinning it right now. Pin 65, 70, 75, 80, 81. That, from a passenger perspective, the fact that we didn't hit the top of the roof right there, that's insane. That was scary. That's crazy. <laughs> that was scary. That was 80 miles an hour into Dude. like a big whoop. All right, she gets down. She gets down. Now that we've gotten a little bit comfortable with the car, we know how it feels, we know how it generally handles. Let's get down to what we're really here for. The whoop section. Here we go. We found what we think is the best section. It's our best shot. There's no other, nothing else I can say other than your boys just gotta absolutely send it. I'm really excited, but I'm a little, a little nervous. It's fun, but I'd be lying if I said it wasn't scary. It's definitely a little scary. There's only so much adrenaline my body can pump today. Let's get a little pump up song. All right. Oh, here we go. Let's go! Ford Super Duty F250 off-road suspension test. Here we go. That was so f***ing aggressive. It, it it pulls me out at a certain point. Like, that got real violent. I don't know if the truck could take any more than that. Dude, that was gnarly. That you was went, gnarly. You went through like the biggest stuff. All right, just making sure because I was like, there, I, I just told Cody, I'm like, I don't think there is more than that. No, you center punched <laughs> the biggest section. All right, because it was like, feel like I just drove F1. Yeah, so that that's like the limit of the steering linkage on the truck Ooh. at this point. Got it? That's the reaction we needed! Yeah. That's the reaction I needed! So it took us about five to six different attempts to get the exact clip that we wanted. So I need you to go a little, uh, a lot faster. I found it pretty difficult with my truck because it kept throwing pre-collision warnings and anti-crash warnings, which was taking over my steering. And even more dangerous, it was pulling me out of throttle, which on a whoop section is just a disaster waiting to happen. Oh, God! Oh. But at the end of the day, after all of the efforts, I can confidently say that we got the clips that we were looking for.
right, well, that was so fun and scary and all the right feelings. I'm gonna say we did it. I think that we achieved, you know, I think we actually pushed it more than I thought we could. There were a couple times where I got a little bit uncomfortable. Where I was like, we gotta get this shot. I know we gotta do it. Look at that thing. I'm so out of my element, which made this video so fun. I think that you guys could see that through this video. We did some playing around all day. I feel official. I feel like with CJC's help and all the team there, we're officially truck, truck boys. <sighs> big explosion. I'm hyped on this. I wanna give a really big shout out to Cody and Andrew who they've been hiding in the background here, but this whole entire video could not have been done without them. One, just with Cody like deciding to work with an idiot like me and fulfilling this dream. It was so sick. So I wanna give a big shout out to CJC. I wanna give a big shout out to Carly. Big shout out to Cam C. Shout out to Baja Design. Shout out to Nitto. All this was done by them. And without their help, this wouldn't have happened. And I'm so happy that it did. And thank you for making this a reality. And if you guys want this, the most ridiculous setup, but have a setup that actually works, is it novelty? I almost went the cheap route before finding CJC, which was all thanks to you guys. You guys all commented down below. I almost went the cheap route. And I feel like it would have upset a lot of you guys. And I'm really glad that we didn't. And I can 100% say this product works and rocks and I'm just, I'm just hyped. I'm just so hyped. I think this is your world, so you're like, <laughs> yeah, it's what yeah. we do. But I'm just like, damn, that was tight. I hope you guys enjoyed this one as much as I did. I want to give, a, again, a massive shout out to Cody and everyone at CJC. I want to link them down below. They're in LA. If you have a Super Duty or a Dodge that needs a little bit of help, that is the place to go. I'll see you boys in the next one. I'm alive. Thank God. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out and keep moving.